Today, we're diving into a topic that we all encounter but rarely understand. Cookies. No, not the delicious chocolate chip ones. I'm talking about the website cookies that pop up every time we browse. Ever wondered what really happens when you don't accept them? Stick around because I'm about to unravel this digital mystery. All right, let's start with the basics. Cookies are small pieces of data stored on your device by your web browser. They help websites remember your preferences and actions, like your login details or the items in your shopping cart. Sounds harmless, right? There are three main types of cookies. Session cookies, which disappear when you close your browser. Persistent cookies, which stay until you delete them. And third-party cookies, which track you across different sites. This is where things can get a little sticky. So, what happens when you hit that Accept All Cookies button? Sure, you get a more personalized experience when you shop or browse like seeing product recommendations based on your most recent visit. But there's a catch. Those elusive third-party cookies enable companies to track your online behavior. They collect data on your browsing habits, shopping preferences, and even your location. This info is often sold to advertisers who target you with specific ads. So, while you get that tailored experience, your online privacy takes a hit. Now, what happens if you decide to decline those cookies? It may seem like you're escaping the clutches of sneaky tracking, but it's not that simple. Even without your consent, websites can still collect info about your interactions. They can use techniques like fingerprinting, which tracks unique details about your device like your operating system, browser type, and settings. This method is harder to detect and provides a highly detailed profile of your online identity. So, what can you do to protect your privacy? Here are some alternatives. Use private browsing mode. This limits data stored during your browsing session. Block third-party cookies. Most browsers have settings to help you do this. Browser extensions. Tools like ad blockers can help cut down tracking. Educate yourself on privacy policies. It's like reading the fine print before signing a contract. So, what will you do the next time that cookie pop-up appears? Accept? Decline? Or maybe just hit customize? Remember, understanding what cookies are and how they work is the first step toward taking control of your online privacy. Thanks for joining me today.